Hi hello this is Anoop here and in this video we are going to see the new production version of SSCM 1902 and how to install that and how to upgrade that. So if I'm not wrong this would be a baseline version of SSCM production because the last baseline version was 1802. If I'm not wrong I think 1902 will be uh, the next baseline version. So once we have baseline version, we can upgrade SSCM 2012 servers to 1902 directly. I don't know the supportability of it. I, I never heard about it. Let's go to the documentation of 1902 and see what are the things over here. If you are running 1710, 1802, 1806, 1810 versions of SSCM current branch, then you will get 1902 version in your SSCM console. If you are running SSCM with online service connection point, then you will get 1902 version within the console. If you are running an offline version of service connection point, then you may need to follow the offline method. And it's very important to go through the checklist of 1902 before installing the version in your production environment. But I would always recommend to install it initially on your development environment or lab or staging environment before going into production. So let's see what is deprecated features and operating systems. So Linux and Unix client that is deprecated already. And the other one is 1902 onwards you won't be able to create standalone cloud distribution points. So cloud distribution points are part of CMG now. and you have an option to enable cloud DP within CMG itself. So I have a blog post about that, how to enable that. I can provide you the link in the description of this video. I already completed the uh, boring part, clicking next, 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 downloading the updates and started the installation. As you can see over here, the replication, it's, it's there in the replication. Now I just wanted to click refresh and let's see what is happening. There is a yellow warning in prerequisite check. That is fine because I'm having some problem with my domain controller. So that's fine. The installation is completed. Post installation is going on. Turning on the feature. That's fine. I think now I should get a console notification. The new console notification if I'm not wrong. I don't know why I'm not getting it. So it says 1902 is installed this is the production version of 1902 most of the folks will be downloading it and testing it in their staging environment or or in their lab environment when microsoft releases it on fast channel or fast ring i don't know whatever let me close the console and open it again it says new console version is available. I will just cancel it to just make sure whether the new notification node is available in the console or not. Hmm. Can't see that. I don't know why. Let's wait for some time and check. Ah, this is new one. Exciting one. The community workspace is there. So I have a couple of blogs about this. What is community workspace and what are the features available in that. At the moment in the production environment it is only documentation. But in preview environments you can see there are other nodes over here under community. That is basically that will be like hubs and other stuff. From where you can download scripts and reports community scripts and reports and once you download the scripts it will directly go into your software library and scripts so i think you won't be able to see that notification in the older console because i am running an older version older version of um, sscm console so so basically this is the 1810 version of console right you won't be able to see that notification in 1810 console notification ribbon over here that is very useful and i love that i have shown in previous videos uh, of sscm preview version how that looks like so let's close it again and update the console also okay it says install okay let's upgrade the console or update the console it's downloading the files 
I don't think it is downloading from the internet. Okay, the console installation is going to complete now. Let's see. So the console got installed. Let's check the version of the console. What is the console version over here? So let's see. Console version 5.1902, 1902, 10, 85, 15, And the site version is 5087. 90100 that is a console version and let's go to the administration and check what is the client version and the site server version or full version the client version over here is 5008790100105 and the full version is 5008790100 this client version could be a different for your installation of SSCM. I'm part of the tab uh, probably because of that the client version is the earliest one. That is quite possible. And let's have a quick look at the features. I don't think there will be much over here. I can't find anything new over here that is normal. Don't get me wrong, there are a lot of updates and enhancements, feature enhancements in this version of 1902. And first one is after the console upgrade, the icon of community tab got changed. Now it's a different icon. That's really nice. And you can see the documentation node over here from where you can check the documentation and other stuff. 1902 comes with many features and many enhancements. Face deployments, office management, software updates, software sender, OS deployment. You can see a walkthrough of all these features in my next video. Thank you for watching. See you next time.